Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to the Morning English Podcast. My name is Peter Joseph Kuhn from Boston, Massachusetts, and I will be your foreign host today. Hello, Peter. Welcome. Um, 欢迎大家来到今天的早安英文 I'm your Chinese host, Juan. Hello, welcome to Morning English. 早安英文呢是一个为大家免费提供英语教学的频道，每天都会更新。如果你想获得关于英语听说读写的内容，我们都会在这个频道更新。我们的目标是帮助全球的华人学好英语。如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。And today we're going to be talking about all the different names of roads.、Mm-hmm. I know, Peter, there are a lot of road names in English, but not so many in Chinese, right? That's right. The only ones I can think of are like Dadao,、mm. Gaojia, Lu, Xiang, Anyu Xiang, the Xiang. Xiang, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's where <laughs> I kind of live.、Uh, but in English, there are a whole lot more of ways to say road and streets, and I'm going to try and explain them to you. 嗯，你的中文词汇量还是 very very good. <laughs> 哪里哪里 <laughs> Okay, so 今天呢，我们就要给大家聊一聊各种各样路的说法 Yep. All right. So in a western town or city, you may wonder. Why some streets are called streets and others are called roads?、Mm. Historically, there was a difference between a street and a road, which is still relevant today. 啊、uh, ，对啊，就是你发现没有，在每一个城市都会有 in China， 每一个城市都会有解放路啊，八一路。Mm-hmm. 然后我们这边的话会翻译成 road， 有的地方会翻译成 street。Mm-hmm. 所以 street 到底是哪一种啊？ So, street is a paved public road that only appears in a city or town, not really in like a rural area, like a village. We don't say there's streets、uh-huh. there. Usually, there are shops or stores or houses along both sides of a street. Which facilitates public interaction. Ah,、uh, so street 的感觉就是那种比较城市里的大街， mm. 对吧？然后两边会有很多商店的那种热闹的感觉。Mm-hmm. Right. So how about a road? A road is characterized by a route or way on land between two places that has been paved to allow travel by transport. So it's a little more vague. Ah,、uh, not as specific. Ah.、Uh, 所以我觉得有一首歌可以帮大家很好的理解 road，、yeah. 对吧？这个词、right. 感觉 country road take me home. Yeah,、right? exactly. Actually, over time, like like I said, there's a historical difference.、Mm. Well, over time, a road that once connected two towns or villages that were close to each other is still called a road,、mm. even though now those two towns or villages became part of a large. Larger city, city. Yeah. exactly. 嗯，所以现在大家可能会有一点混着用啊，但是基本上就是总结一下这个感觉的话呢，就是 street 它会是街道两边的那种有商店的大街，但是 road 的话呢，就是指城市或者是乡村之间那种工人走过的那种平坦的大路， mm. 对吧？嗯、mm.。There is one more thing that you have to know. A road can also be used to talk about the actual construction,、uh, like materials of a road or street.、Mm. So when a street or road is being repaired, it is called road works, not street works. Ah,、uh, so this is a fixed expression. So on the wall, you have to pay attention. So if we are talking about Something is under construction. We can only say road work, but not street works. Correct. Right? Exactly. So there is another word. 有点 confusing 的，就是 the Fifth Avenue. Ah,、uh, right. 那 avenue 和这些有什么区别啊？ You find avenues typically in cities. A street, a、uh, uh, avenue is a straight street or road with trees planted along both sides. Avenues are typically wider than streets, sometimes、uh. having more lanes and therefore more traffic. Ah,、uh, so it is avenue, 就比 street 感觉要更加的繁华一些 Yes, 对吧 Exactly. So, 刚刚 Peter 还说了一个词叫做 lane,、mm-hmm. 对吧 Lane 就是小的这个车道，比如说 Do not hog the middle lane. Yes, 对吧 Correct. Lane 就车道，所以 avenue 通常就会比较宽，它可能有好几条车道的这种城市主干道的感觉。嗯哼，嗯。And、uh, in some cities in the U.S. that are based on a grid system, grid system. So like、uh, they are like First Avenue, Second Avenue,、mm. Third Avenue. They're all like in a line, ah, next, 就是非常 per- parallel or perpendicular、uh, to each other. Um, um, and yeah, so 
Cities that are streets that are based on a grid system, streets and avenues are the same, with the difference that streets run from west to east, uh, while avenues really? run north to south. Ah. Note that in other U.S. cities, this may be reversed, mm. and the streets go north to south, and avenues from west to east.、Uh. Thus, in city centers like downtown, you will almost never find two avenues that intersect. 啊、uh, ，所以这个很有意思啊，就是在有的城市里面呢 ，streets 和这个 avenues 它的意思是相同的，但是它可能方向不一样。比如说南北方向的它可能叫做 avenue， 然后东西方向的叫做 street。嗯哼。比如说，呃、uh, ，like it's on the corner of the Patriot Street and the Sixth Avenue。Perfect, you got it。对吧 ？I、okay, got it。对，所以，呃、uh,。那在中文里面还有一个就是词啊，就是呃叫林荫大道，是不是有这个词， mm-hmm. 对吧 ？So I'm guessing that could be boulevard. Ah, boulevard, 对吧 ？Yes. So it's kind of like French, right? Ah,、uh, yeah. A lot of these words do come from French. Um, actually, English does is French is a one of the largest influencers of English, along with German and Latin. Ah. So that's why you see so many French words in English. Um.、Uh, but yes, boulevard is similar to an avenue. However, it can sometimes be even larger than an avenue, and it is similar to an avenue where usually there are trees on both sides, and um. Also, there is usually buildings, or can be buildings on each side too,、mm. um, and also multiple lanes. Ah, so boulevard 其实也是这种就是林荫大道的感觉，两边有很多的这个树呀什么的，中间可能还会有一些花坛什么的，就很宽， mm. 对吧？嗯、mm. ，exactly， 可能也是城市的主干道的这种感觉，<笑>对吧？是不是？所以那个呃，还有一个就是中文当中我们会经常说的一个说法，就是一条死胡同，嗯哼，对吧 ？So that's called a cul-de-sac. Cul-de-sac. Yes. How how to spell it? So C U L dash D E dash S A C. Cul-de-sac.、Uh, that's so not English, right? <laughs> right. It's very strange. <laughs> yeah. It is also from French.、Mm. It is a street that is closed at one end.、Mm. So sometimes it's usually <clears throat> the end of it is a circle,、mm. uh, or I should say semicircle. Sometimes the end of the street has a large round paved area.、Mm. From above it, it has the shape of like an old light bulb. Ah, like a light bulb, like this. This kind of road is called a cul-de-sac. Right.、Mm. So it's shaped like an old light bulb if you're looking at it from the sky,、mm. making it easier for vehicles to turn around and go back out、uh-huh. the other way. Hmm. Hmm. Last one we want to talk about is that every city has a main road in China called a pedestrian street. A pedestrian street. <laughs> 这个是中国特色吗 ？Chinese characteristic.、Um, like, you, yeah, you well, there's、that. a lot of walking streets in China. Yeah,、like、but do you have like、it. pedestrian street in the United States? Do you have this kind of thing? We sure do.、Um, but you, like, for example, like Times Square. Ah,、uh, Times、like、Square. That's like a pedestrian street. Ah, so you. People are not allowed to drive there, right? Right.、Mm. There is usually just an.、Uh, actually, there's a lot of pedestrian streets all over all over America,、mm. um, and it's usually just shops and stores. Um, and usually for like, it's usually a touristy area. Ah, so it's usually a very large amount of people walking around in the street, but they can't drive, and there are a lot of shops and stores, right? Exactly. Okay. Right. Um. Thank you. Hello. Welcome to Morning English. 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 如果你觉得还不错的话，记得给我们订阅哦。另外，点开小铃铛，这样的话就不会错过其他任何学习视频啦。对了，如果你想获取本节课的完整版笔记，在视频简介或者评论区领取哦。你也可以给这个视频点赞，点赞就相当于自动保存啦。All right, hope you guys enjoyed today's show. 嗯、mm. ，And I'll see you next time. See you next time. Bye. Bye bye.